Hi guys, um, so my name's Steph, and, um, this week for our weekly vlog, our assignment was to take a quiz on our creativity, and, um, pretty much we just had to answer, like, 16 questions, and after I answered all my 16 questions, um, my score told me that I got a 60, so, um, after I read all the results, uh, my mine was going to mean that creativity is one of my strengths and innovative and creative minds are highly set out and um, because I'm creative and I kind of knew that this was one of my strengths um, but because I'm creative uh, I always have a lot of suggestions when I'm put in a group setting so like when you need to come up with ideas for stuff um, like uh, when our group just first gets together and we start brainstorming, um, I'm kind of the one that like blurts out a bunch of ideas, and um, I I think that's okay, but and it's a good help to the group. But sometimes um, it's like not presented in the most organized way. Like I'm literally just saying things that come to my head and blurting them out. So. Um, as I continue all this group work and stuff through school and everything, uh, I'll of course support everyone's ideas, um, like for the group when they come out and say things, you know, give their ideas, and I'll continue to be supportive. Um, but I, what I want to change for myself is when I begin to present my ideas, I kind of want to have it more in an organized manner and. Um, like have everything that I want to say written down, um, maybe have some facts about them or something so people can really understand where I'm coming from, just stuff like that. So um, I think this exercise is really helpful because I never thought to myself that I should present things in a different way because I always have ideas, um, nor did I know that I would get the highest score in the, in the level you know, where they told you where creativity was. So that's all for this week. Thanks.